It doesn't take much time on a college campus to learn something about this generation's social habits. All around campus, you will see people with their heads down, focused on their phones, or staring at a computer screen, oblivious to their environment. It is without a doubt that the technological advances over past decades have been phenomenal. But as a result of this, our generation has become addicted to the constant feed of information and entertainment that is available to them. In this generation, conversation is now typed and friendships are measured in the number of likes and retweets. Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, and other social networks being made available on cell phones and computers allow users to tap into the digital world anytime, any place. So do you feel like you have an addiction to your cell phone? Uh, yeah, during class I can't, not like my phone at least three times, and I freak out when I leave it. When I go to class and I feel like I left in my room, like I can't, I have to go back and get it before class. Do you ever like uh, find yourself on your phone whenever you're around your friends and stuff like that? Yeah, usually like they're talking to me and I'm looking down my phone, really that's what they're asking me, have a lot. Even while students are in the library, an environment for schoolwork, Social networks cover computer screens and phones are in hands, distracting users from getting their work done. Whether working alone or in a group, these distractions seem almost unavoidable. So, do you feel like you have an addiction to your cell phone at all? Uh, I definitely think I have an addiction to my cell phone. I look at my phone probably every half an hour, just checking Twitter, Instagram, and what's going on at all times. So it definitely takes me away from my friends. And I have, my friends have told me that it takes me away from uh, talking to them. So your friends have noticed that like sometimes whenever you have your phone out, you're completely engaged in that and not with it. Yeah, sometimes I get uh, a little too much of my phone and it just distracts me from what's going on. We are even willing to risk our own lives and text while we are driving or scroll down our Twitter timeline while in traffic. Face-to-face -face conversation has lost value. Our generation, in many ways, have become more comfortable sharing their thoughts through a keyboard or on an iPhone than in person. So they were both at the party at the same time, and his girlfriend watched the whole thing. Could you believe that? Chris. Chris. Uh, oh, uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that was crazy.